and some last minute touches and ooh. I think we're all done. It's so juicy. Mm. Mm. <sighs> You're back. <laughs> Damn it, why you gotta see me like this? It's been three weeks. Oh, not me slobbering. Sorry. <laughs> Hello. Um, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for hopping back in on. <laughs> Sorry for leading you on. I'm okay. I'm fine. I just hate editing videos. So what are we doing today? Well, I had this amazing idea from this channel to do exactly this. So it's not really my idea. It's their idea. It was so much fun to watch. I'll link it below. But essentially, we are doing the same thing. We are redrawing my old sketchbook. I did have to funnel through some old sketchbooks to see which one I wanted to recreate or redraw. And I ended up choosing this one. It was from, this one was from high school. It was freshman year, which would have been 2012. One more thing before we begin, I did time myself when I did these drawings. I didn't want to go past about 12 minutes. Because of my camera, it kind of limits. So I try to keep it as minimal as possible. Plus, my SD card was filling up really quickly. So none of the sketches will be really in detail. I will say some of them I did skip. For the most part, I did most of them. Gotta give me credit there. Ooh, enough of me rambling. Go ahead, grab a snack, grab a pencil, grab something to draw with, art with, and let's get cooking. I ain't gonna choke you, I promise. I got a new camera. I'm not touching it. Not playing. <laughs> hmm. I wanna do it, but I can't. <laughs> so let's begin, this is the sketchbook. Watch this transition. Oh, that was so juicy. Here's the first page. Um, I don't know what I was thinking when I first drew this, um, but I wanted to make it just a little bit more my style. I did forget to mention that all these sketches will be in color pencil or pen. I'm not gonna be using pencil because I don't wanna be using uh, the eraser because if I'm out here fixing mistakes, this would have taken me forever. So yeah, like I said, I don't know what I was thinking. This would have been my freshman year of high school. I think I remember drawing this in our big room. We had like a big room and I was just sketching it. Nothing major, color pencil and pen. That was it. I like the new one better, but you know, let me know. Oh, and another thing I forgot to mention is I'm not gonna be using any reference photos for any of these drawings. I'm simply just redrawing from the old drawing. Um, also, I was really experimental with like bodies back then and I need to get back into that because that was so much fun. Anyways, the remake, I wanted to make it a little bit more organic and not so stiff. She looks like a plank um, and I really like the remake. I, yeah, I just wish I would have went into more contrast and detail, but we can't be perfect. I wanted, like I said, I wanted to stay within, you know, six to 12 minutes. Now I'll say I like the composition of this uh, old piece because I don't know, I think it's cute. But the hair, I don't know what I was thinking about the hair. I thought the cross hatching thing was like very new, very edgy. I clearly didn't know how to do hair back then besides do lines. So in the redraw, I figured color pencil, let's fill it in, make it more, not realistic, but you know, more my style now um, and make the hair more realistic. I also decided, as you can see, to turn it into like an elf like person uh, because I don't know anybody else who has a head sticking out on the other side of their face. But I think it's really cute. I think it reads well. The hair looks like more like hair, I would say. And that's what it looks like. I like the new one a lot better, um, but let me know. So on to the next one. Are you gonna flip the damn it hurt Damn. So I was also obsessed with doing like the half face thing. I think everybody was at the time. This was like 2012. Uh, and let me tell you, I was doing it with all my drawings. This is Marilyn Monroe with a skull, of course. I think I did it for somebody that wanted a tattoo and obviously they never did it because I think we were like 14, 15, I don't know. So as I mentioned, I'm not using a reference photo. I'm just simply using the old drawing. And uh, yeah, it does not read well as Marilyn Monroe. It doesn't even read well as a skull. Forgive me, I did rush on this one because I knew it wouldn't be up to my standards. I do, and I will say I like the old one better. That's why I pointed to it. Next one, please. Flip, come, hurry up. I'm done looking at it. I guess I was taking my sweet time. Anyways, this next one, I was obsessed with The Walking Dead and zombies. I still am obsessed with zombies. Not so much The Walking Dead. It has gone into a complete... Anyways, not going to get into that. It'll take me forever. Like I said, obsessed with the Walking Dead, how to make a zombie. I think for the old drawing, I did use a reference photo. I can't remember. But in the redraw, I did want to make it a little bit more expressionist. I wanted it to be more detailed and just a little scarier. It kind of reminds me of those illustrations in this uh, Scary Stories book. Um, just the way everything kind of like sh is shaded. But I like the redraw a lot better. Um, the Walking Dead, I wrote it on the side. But yeah, the redraw, in my opinion, is a lot better, even though it's a little rushed. On to the next one. Thank you. 
So back then, I also was obsessed with drawing the side of the face. Um, you'll probably see quite a few of them. I am not a fan of this redraw at all. I was just not feeling it. It, mm, gosh, looking back at it, it's just, it's just ugly. I did want to kind of turn this into a painting, but yeah, I'm not thinking that anymore. I don't like the redraw. I don't even like the original that much. They're blowing something in his face. I don't know. Anyways, next one, please. Oh, okay. Yep, like I said, very much obsessed with the side of the face and I guess green liquid. So I kind of like how this one turned out, but um, I don't know. It's just not as expressioned as I wanted it to be. But I think it turned out pretty nicely. I wish I would have went in with a darker color pencil, but you know, I already started. I ain't going to stop. So the green liquid, I rushed on and then I tried to darken some areas. That's what it looked like. I do like the new one a little bit better, but the old one is iconic. Next one is, ooh, this one. So I really love doing the half and half faces at the time. It's not so much a thing anymore, but love doing it. One half is like old, the other half is supposed to be young, but I don't know, it, it doesn't really look like that in the old picture. But I kind of wanted to do it in the new one, um, but I ended up just making my face like I always do. It looks like me, huh? Well, hello. <clears throat> Sorry, that was a hiccup. But uh, I, you know, I think it's cute. It very much is slanted like I wanted it to look, but you know, it's pretty basic. On to the next one, please. Okay, yep, thank you. On to the next one. Here we go, we're getting some juicy parts. So this is all pen. I was actually really proud of this old drawing because I only used pen. I did not use any uh, eraser or anything. I just strictly used pen. Very, very proud of this one. I do remember making it. I was kind of sad in class and I just wanted to make something moody. In the redraw, I'm not going as realistic as I was. I want to keep it very stylized. I'm not going to be looking at any reference. Um, and I don't know. This, out of all of them, this one ended up being one of my favorites. I think the girl is so cute. It's like, oh, she's so pretty. I, uh, I'm i proud of it. I love the old one and the new one very much. On to the next one. Oh, God. What? Not the Grinch with no hair. Not the Grinch with no hair. Ugh. No. I had to redraw this one, as you can tell. I was like, oh, I was getting too into it. <laughs> I was getting too into it. Oh, gosh. Yeah. No, this might. Uh, yeah, this is. I don't even know what to say. It's something. It is very much something. Uh, this is not a human being. This is an alien. So I didn't really try hard on this one at all because I was not feeling it. Um, but on to the next one. This one is more of a doodle, so I designated some doodle pages so I don't have to waste a whole page. This is the first doodle page, and I chose red because, you know, I'm. this one was a fun one. But I don't know what I was thinking about the, the cone head. It, it didn't really look the cutest, but this is it. That's what it looked like. I like the old one better. It just looks a little cooler. I, and as you can probably tell, I was really loving making bald people because not only am I balding now, but um, it, it's easier to make because you don't have to draw hair. And I was not the best at drawing hair back then at all. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what I was thinking of doing the gray over the purple. It was not my favorite doodle at all. But that's my doodle page so far. On to the next one. Please move. Thank you. I love this self-portrait. It's so funny. I was so excited to start this one. Um, I wanted to start it in pen. So the original was all in pen. No pencil, no erasing at all. I did change it up a bit with the new one because I wanted to start it in pen, do as much shading as possible, and then go in with uh, color pencil. I only do that because it saves time doing all this cross hatching with the pen just to add a whole bunch of you know contrast and, and value. It it sucks. I wanted to hurry up and get this done because after like the fifth page of the sketchbook, I wanted to quit. I'm not even kidding you. Halfway through, I'm like, okay, yeah, this video is probably going to be boring to a lot of people. And, you know, it might be still boring. Who knows? But I think it's fun. I like the new one better than the old one. Now, this is going to be on another doodle page because, you know, it's kind of a doodle. Now, the old one is more realistic. I wanted to kind of make it super funky in the new one. I mean, there's really not much to say about this one at all. I just wanted to make it funny looking. And, oh, green. <sighs> I I think I picked up the wrong color and I already started it. So, yep, that's my excuse. This is it. Next one, please. I don't want to look at it. Please. 
Damn, move the page. Thank you. No, oh, yep, I skipped this one. Nope, I'm not even going to try it. No, ma'am. Oh, I did try it. Never mind. Uh, yep, nope, never mind. I erased it. This is another sketch page, and I was like, nah, I'm not going to redo this one. Here's a pumpkin. Um, I have a little problem with pumpkins. I tried it. Tried my best. Nope. I wasn't even going to try it. This is another one. I said, hell no. 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 So, here's another page. There we go. Hello. So, this one, I don't even remember drawing this one. I wanted to keep the face shape because I thought it was funny. And just maybe move it around a little bit. As you can tell, it's kind of slanted like I always like to do. Um, I went in with red again, which I kind of regret because I don't like how it looked with the red. TBH. It just didn't look right. And I did rush this one again. I am so sorry. This is just going to be me, like, literally rushing on all these drawings. I am so very sorry. But on to the next one. Oh, my gosh. Why did I do so much hair in the wind drawings and then it gives in the face? Like, I thought I was really doing something. Anyways, I was not a fan of this redraw. Um, I think I, once again, I choose the wrong, you know, color pencil. It's not as dark as I wanted it to, so it was really hard to get the contrast right. And I just rushed it. TBH. On to the next one. Ugh. Ugh. What is this? Oh, I don't like drawing bodies. So I pretty much rushed this one again. I'm so sorry. And this one was a rushed one in pen. I like the old one better than the new one. Clearly. And here's the one that makes me so sad. I love this drawing so much. I remember drawing this. I, once again, I was in class. Not really paying attention. And just wanted to draw like a cyclops, a very beautiful cyclops. I was trusting the process with the pen. I wanted to keep the same kind of features, but change them up just a little bit to refresh the style. I used green, as you could, as you could tell. Wanted to go for a bl black ivy or red ivy, that one superhero lady or the villain. It didn't, I didn't like it. Um, next one. What the hell? What is that? I don't know what that is. Another doodle. I'm, I'm making this one a doodle page. Ugh, no nose. All Cupid's bow and eyeballs, pretty much. And some strangly hair. <laughs> I hope you guys don't get bored with this. I apologize. The descriptions aren't the best. This one? Oh, I'm excited for this one. I think I like actually like this one. Um, this one was all in pen. I did the face. And then I said, you know what? I'm going... I'm talking about the old one, by the way. I did the face, I left the face for a while, and then I had found like a sharpie or something and did the hair, and then I ended up ruining it, but I do like the remake of it, the green, the red, I wanted some rep, red, rep redemption, redemption with the green and the red, I think it looks cute, not my favorite with the hair, but I think it's cute, next one please, I love this original drawing, I love this original drawing, however I didn't film it, I didn't film the drawing at all, I was, no, I didn't film it. What the hell? I don't know what happened to the SD card. Next one, please. It's going to irritate me. Next one, another kind of droopy side face thing. Yep. And, oh, I made it. Why did I make it so small? I don't know why I made it so small. Kept the nose kind of the same shape, though. I thought that was pretty neat. Go in with some colored pencil. Make all the shines. What? Damn, fast forward much? This one is also one of my favorites. Oh, and I hated the new one so much. I... I remember that face in the original one it took me forever because it was so small. Like one thing you won't see me doing now is making super small drawings or, or paintings because I love working big. I feel like I can work more detail into it because every time I work super small, I overwork the details and I get too caught up into it. That drawing on the left hand corner is not mine by the way. I don't know what I was thinking about this original drawing or the remake. I should have just skipped it because I'm about to because I give up. I give up. Next one. Thank you. I like this original drawing too. This one's pen and pencil. Um, the new one is just regular pen and uh, color pencil. I made it a little bit larger, changed some of the facial structure. Um, the shadows on the face didn't make any sense. Um, so I just kept it the same way because I was not about to put any brain power into thinking about the shadows. I did fix it up just a little bit. I like how... I don't even know the word. I like how musty he looks. Is that the right word? Nope. Anyways, next one, please. Move the page. Oh, 
Another doodle. Oh, yay. I really just wasted all these pages, huh? Just to make a little face. Yeah, this is... I'm so sorry if this is not interesting to you. Um, I did end up... Oh, God, why is everybody contacting me right now? I did end up uh, putting more detail into the side of the face. And I really like the original. Damn! The next one. This is actually one of my classmates from a while ago. Um, I don't know. I can't even remember his name. I, we weren't really friends. I just was like, hey, can I draw you or whatever? And he said, yeah. Um, so the original, I can't remember what he looks like. I know he looks like more like the original than he does in my remake. But, you know, I'm just trying to make it into my style. So I even put a little mustache. I doubt he'll ever watch this, but hey, I hope you're doing well. Uh, it's been almost 10 years, so I hope you're very much juicy. Next one, please. Oh, this is our scribble. Oh, oh. I don't like this one at all. I don't know what would, like I said, I didn't really know how to do hair back then, so I really just made like five lines for the hair and called it a day. <laughs> well, that's kind of what my hair looks like now when, when the sun goes through it. Oh. Not me getting, I was about to hiccup, I'm so sorry. I do like the remake. I think it's more sculptural, very, very um, expression and like, it's there's movement. Next one, please, that's not my drawing. Oh, I actually have a story on this one, I don't know if I'll have time, but there was, um, I worked at the movie theater, there was poop all over this stall and I had to make a creative story about it. And pretty much I made a story about how there was this creature coming out of the, bat, bat, uh, the, the stink. Next one. Ugh. Ugh, I don't like this one at all. This is going to be on another on, on another doodle page. Oof. So I just made a small face and a big head. I don't make I don't I have one of the worst memories when it comes to like things that are quick, if that makes sense. So yeah, I don't remember making that drawing. I don't remember making this either. Uh, I still am not a fan of making bodies, but I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone. Um, like I said, I was very experimental with bodies back then. Very experimental. And I want to get back into doing that because I feel like I learned a lot back then and I can learn a lot now. Uh, but I do I do like this remake. I think it's cute and I think it's funny. and be, It'd be really cool to remake this as a painting and multiple people with it. This next one, another doodle. I love how I wasted an yet another page to make a sketch. Like, not even a whole sketch. Just like a... Ugh, anyways. I do like this remake. Um, it's a little different. I wish I wouldn't have made it on the same page as the other one because it kind of ruins the page. But I do like the remake. It, it's a little different. Same sh face shape, though. Next. Thank you. This is actually some ideas of the Alfred Hitchcock... A portrait that I made like a while ago so long story short I was obsessed with Alfred Hitchcock I wanted to do a portrait of him and this was just like some ideas that never came uh, to an actual drawing so I'm doing it now it doesn't really look like Alfred Hitchcock in the remake but it does look like him in the old one but I made it very cubism ish next one please thank you another doodle I think this was in pencil I can't even tell I know yeah that was in pencil so I did on another doodle page um, well, I can't I don't think I was a fan of this one like I don't think I was a fan of the remake or the old one um, At this point you could probably tell I was rushing I was rushing to get done because I had spent already two days on this and uh, It was getting to me This one is also a good one that I ended up going into a lot of detail with Because I really liked it and I think I might turn this into a painting. I don't know but, uh, yep, it, it's like a man on a chair, and the man is sad. That's pretty much it. Gosh, this commentary is horrible. I am so sorry. If you are still here, I for, for please forgive me from this commentary. I don't know what else to say, really. Um, I, I had lemon cake today. But I do like how the chair is in the re a remake, and obviously it's actually finished. I'm not redrawing this. I'm not even going to go into detail. This is an eyeball and a nose that I wasted a whole page on. Yep, so I'm going to do exactly that. Put it on the doodle page and make an eye and a nose. That's it. Hated it. Next. Flip the damn page. Flip it! I'm done. Thank you. This is actually the last page. The last page. And I am actually super happy that it is the last page because it was a self-portrait that I made a long time ago that I never even thought of finishing i did the nose and i'm like nah i quit 
I'm so glad I did the remake because I really am in love with the remake. Um, I wish I wouldn't went into a little bit more detail and didn't rush it as much, but like I said, I was on a time restraint and I thought I had more pages left. Um, I like how I did the hair though. I rushed the hair, but I like how I did it. This also has to be one of my favorite ones that I redrew. Um, I also thought there were more pages after this, so I clearly was really excited to be done. But yeah, that's me kind of flipping through all the pages very much. Ooh, close the book. Thumbs up, I guess. Well, hello, my friends. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you have any questions, concerns, please let me know down below. As always, if you have any suggestions, please let me know as well. But no, I really had fun with this, uh, you know, trip to memory lane. It was pretty cool to see some of my older sketchbooks. Um, I don't really like to go through them too often because I like to be surprised every time I go through them. I also have little notes in between some of them. So if you guys want to see me flip through some notebooks, let me know. I'll be down to do that. And I highly recommend doing this as a challenge. As an artist, I learned a lot looking at my old sketches. So go ahead and try it for yourself. Now, it wasn't easy. I did have to space this out between like a couple days, but I got it done. I got it done. And before you click off, please let me know what your favorite sketch was. I hope everybody's staying creative and juicy since the moment we last saw each other. A couple big things have been going on, such as my Etsy shop. I sold a whole bunch of originals. It was amazing. I hope to launch it again next month, so stay tuned. And I do give a lot of my updates on Instagram, so if you want to go follow me, go ahead. Patreons always get first dips. Dibs? So yeah, stay juicy, stay creative, and uh, pick up a pencil and do something today, please. Bye. Don't look at the back of my head. I did it myself. Bye.